Today we are visiting CM Water Park in southern Tenerife. Mm -hmm. It is the largest water park in all of Europe and it's been rated the number one water park in the world by TripAdvisor many years in a row. Yeah, so we'll see. We, our favorite water park to date has been Atlantis in Dubai. Yeah. And we loved that one. So yeah. we'll see if it lives up to that. Yeah. It was about 40 euros per person. Mm -hmm. um, parking was seven euros. If you want a fast pass, you have to wait till you're in to get it. So you need to be here early. Parking, there's also not many spaces. Yeah, um, it's, a pain. it's kind of a free for all. It's like a one way. You just park on either side. I personally, we should have parked at the mall and walked over, and it's about probably what less than five minutes yeah. for walking. So. Um, fast pass is 28 euros. The only downside is you can only use it once per ride. So not ideal yeah we're so just we gonna decided to opt out and we'll see it is it looks quite busy right now though it is busy busy and it's like literally just opened so yeah, yeah. We'll go That's check it. it out so we did the first two slides of the day tower of power and naga racer those ones you can't film on so we left the GoPro, did those two just to test them out, and then we got the GoPro for the rest of the slides today. Uh, Tower of Power is fun. It wasn't quite as intense as the one in Atlantis. It's one of those like straight drop slides. I was still freaked out right before, and it was fine. Yeah, and Naga Racer is a typical racing slide. You lay on your mat, four lanes, and it's pretty short. It's nothing super exciting, but I am super excited to try some of these tube slides out.
Well, that's the end of our day at CM Park, and we had a fantastic time. The water slides were tons of fun. Yeah, it was beautiful. It was a really, really well-designed park. Mm -hmm. You could see why it's won as many awards as it has. Yeah, I would recommend going early and getting a fast pass. About halfway through the day, we decided we regretted not getting one and saving yeah. our money. It was so busy, like crazy busy. There was a couple water slides that we spent at least an hour and a half in line, yeah. and it was just, a, we did a ton of waiting today. Yeah, a lot of waiting. So, anyways, the park I would rate like a 10 out of 10 for yeah. its attractions. Our experience today though, I would say like 7.5 out of 10, and the only reason that it was brought down was because of the line waiting. Yeah, it was just super busy. I will say two, the slides that we had in Dubai at Atlantis were definitely a little more intense. There was also a little bigger selection as well. It's like definitely better for those who are thrill seeking, but the way that these were set up, like it was a nicer atmosphere. Yeah, here. it was absolutely beautiful. It was really beautiful. pretty, everything was well done. Yeah, the free Wi Fi throughout the whole park, which is really nice. There's um, lockers that you can put your stuff in for the day. It yep. was seven euros. Yep, and I think it was nine or ten euros for a big locker as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we just got the small one, which was quite large actually, though. Yeah. And yeah, there's tons of um, restaurants and cafes around. Yeah. There are two beaches, both with wave pools. The one big wave pool and beach was really busy. Like but crazy busy. But the uh, one meant for children was really quiet. So if you're just looking to relax for a little bit, I'd scoot on over to that one and yeah. find a chair. That's the one to go to. Yeah. What was your favorite slide today? Mm, Kinnery, I think it was called. I would say the same. That one we actually had a really short wait for too. Like we yeah, we got lucky. Got on in like 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. And it was a really fun slide as well. Yeah, it's the one, it's four people on the tube and there were some scary drops in it. And yeah. some, what are those called? Quarter pipes? Yeah, quarter Half pipe. Half pipe? No, quarter pipe, because you kind of just come up and then back down. Yeah, yeah, it was super fun. And we are obviously going to find some more water parks in the future and hopefully film some more because we really enjoy water parks. Oh yeah, and I think our, I, I've been doing some research and I think we still have quite a few really good ones to hit. So. Yeah, so we'll start ranking them all. Yeah, we'll but start a, a mega list. But if you want to <laughs> see that content, like and subscribe. Thanks guys.